Hi, this is also X for 00x.com and on today's video we'll be showing you the differences and help you uh, differentiate and uh, buy or, or get the Dead Other, the Razer Dead Other Chroma Overwatch Edition, whether it's the copy or the original. Uh, this is the one that I got from a Chinese website, it's the copy, the Dead Other Chroma Overwatch Edition. The packaging wasn't that good and the box was sprinkly. And uh, this is the original Dead Other Chroma by Razer. I got it from eBay. And when I was reading the description for the eBay listing, I was sure that it said original there. An original Razer product. Okay. Uh, you can see the box, all the descriptions on the side are very similar to the knockoff. Uh, there's a price difference. Uh, the other one's like $20, $30, and this one's $40. The other Chroma by Razer has more documentation inside. We'll see that later. This is the Chinese version, not the original. The packaging is very, very similar. It will get them confused from the outside. But the, on the inside, the uh, copy, the Chinese copy, has this uh, green uh, plastic holding the mouse, if you see inside. The mouse itself will look almost identical. You can't tell them apart. The documentation it only has one page of documentation that's a message by Razer, supposedly, and the mouse, it's uh, the usual mouse with the silver tip. It's a mouse connection, USB 2.0 with the silver tip, and the cable has the color scheme of Overwatch and all stuff, and here's the mouse. Okay, the logo, it has the, steer, the wheel, the wheel's a little different from the original, the pattern on the wheel. The mouse itself looks similar, it has a nice weight to it, it has the rubberized contours and all that good stuff. Overall, it's not a bad mouse for 20 bucks, that's what I'm trying to explain here. If you're looking for an Overwatch team mouse, why not? But if you're looking for the original Dead Other Racer Chroma Overwatch Edition, then get it from a, oh, either eBay or your retailer, be sure that says Original Racer Pro. So let's open the original. Uh, Dead Other by Razer, you see the plastic holding the mouse inside is different. You open it, it's, it has the color black, it's, it has black uh, plastic holding the mouse, it's not the green thing. Once we get it out, we'll see more subtle differences. The box is a little better quality, but you can tell the difference from outside. The mouse has the Overwatch logo, it has the uh, the wheel as well and it has more documentation you don't only have the message by Razer but you have the owner's manual the user's manual the warranty and all that good stuff and it's called in place by this uh, plastic uh, apparently you cannot break it you have to take it out and it has a uh, Kenji there it's good to know the differences when you're buying it you see this things you know whether it's an original product or it's a Chinese product that's not made by Razer. So that's the card that's going to uh, the setup a little bit and how to customize the, the lights and how to sync it with the Synapsis software. That's another feature that the Chinese version doesn't have. You, you cannot sync it with the, with the software. Therefore you can customize the mouse light sensitivity and all that to start at speed. And this is the user manual warranty only has two stickers, two Razer stickers to put in your laptop, uh, you know, gear, etc, etc. The cable, also with the Overwatch pattern, it's USB, but the connection is gold, it's a USB 2.0 gold plated connection. It's also braided and this, the differences are subtle. See, it's a gold USB port, USB cables or USB connection, and the mouse itself, the wheel pattern is different. The, peak, the paint on the Chinese version is a little bit offset. That's it's all very subtle, you cannot tell, but this one is just right. It has the rubberized contours, the weight and feel are similar, but this one is a little better quality. You can see high quality on the materials, especially on the top part. And uh, 
the big difference is when you use them, when you try them, with the performance on them. Now this is the other mouse, this is the Chinese version. As you can see on the back side or the, the side that hits the or touches the table or mouse pad, it's almost the same, it looks exactly the same. The cable out and connect it and see what other differences are there. Connected to the laptop. And the light goes on. The wheel uh, has the rainbow pattern while the logo lights up with the respective colors and also it lights up on the sides. You see the orange sides has orange plastic in them or on them they light up as well, so the light lights almost the entire mouse. Uh, rainbow pattern, you can add customize it. If you try to sync it with synapses, it won't allow you to because it's not a Razer product. So the mouse comes as it, as it comes, comes out of the box. You cannot customize any. That said, it's not a bad mouse for 20 bucks, 30 bucks that. It's very accurate, it's pretty good. I think it's just optical and uh, pretty good for productivity, even maybe from some casual game. The wheel feels good, it is rubberized, but over time in a long term test, the rubberized grips on the sides might fall off and it has uh, some glue on it, so you're gonna have to clean that out and stick it back together or just clean the, the glue and leave it like that. Uh, that's under heavy, heavy usage. And again, the sides light up, so the whole mouse light up, the light is strong, special, but it's not as strong as the Razer Pro. Now let's check the official, the original Overwatch Dead Other Chroma by Razer. Let's plug it in, let's plug in that USB gold. Um, connection USB to USB port and you can see the it lights up as well on the back it's similar it's so similar that they look identical the wheel also lights up the rubber ends don't and there's no light coming out of the orange side um, plastics you don't see the light coming through the orange parts but on the logo and on the wheel only just turn off the lights a little bit and yes it only lights up on those two places. The pattern on the wheel is different. It's, it's, very, it's very different. It looks more like a car wheel. Like a, like the like the wheels on a car. Tires. It looks like a tire pattern. Like the rubber tire marks. Now, you can customize the light, you know, what the light does in this mouse with the Synapsis software, which means you can put the rainbow pattern, you can customize the tone, the specific color, use the RGB uh, lighting software, or you can even manage it through the software as saying like the games. Overwatch can tell you what the lights do on the mouse. There's different uh, uh, setups to do it. Now, the light is a little bit stronger than the other mouse. It's stronger, but it doesn't come out of the sides. The rubberized grips are better quality on both sides. All five buttons work similarly, but these ones can be customized, except for the left click, everything else you can customize. All the paint is in place. It's very uh, well made, very well built, similar weight and feel, and uh, first glance, uh, first experience, you experience it the first time, it's not that different. But once you're in game, you can see the difference in the customization, the speed, and the accuracy is not bad on both. But uh, this one allows you to use different uh, setups, different configurations on different games. And you can just change that depending on what your style of gaming is. Okay, now let's see and uh, uh, connect it to the computer. 
playing games, this is how it looks like with the lights off. This is the Chinese version, uh, the Chinese Overwatch mouse. It lights up more, lights up more parts of it, lighter than the original Razer mouse. That isn't, that's not necessarily a good thing, it depends on what your style is. First person shooters and step back. And I would recommend it for productivity too. I don't have a problem with this mouse, I just wanted to test the original Razor product, which is what I need for playing Overwatch. Now, when you play Overwatch with this mouse, has a problem. The original mouse, the Overwatch mouse, might skip a little bit of frames because this is what the technology they're using to move the cursor, which is. Um, better for gaming. This one doesn't have that problem, but this is a Chinese version. It cannot be customized. And the speed and sensitivity can be adjusted. Now, the original Razer mouse, shown here, lights up in less places, just the logo and the scroll wheel, but the movement in-game can be faster. It can be, it can be more sensitive, depending on your settings. That, again, is using the Razer software. As you can see, there's only two places it will light up. I adjusted the wheel uh, on the settings as um, as far as lighting goes to be rainbow as well, the rainbow pattern. And I let the Overwatch logo turn on and off. Uh, those are the kind of things you can customize on the computer with the connection once you sync them. The software can be downloaded at the Racers website uh, under um, Synapses or just look for software for your specific mouse in this case is the dead other chroma by Razer it will be in a list in there and they will tell you what software to download to configure all this good stuff overall this one has a faster response when it comes to game first person shooters uh, even uh, RPGs or rather um, games like LOL like uh, Heroes of the Storm, those games are also fantastic with this mouse. A final comparison, side by side, both of them, well connected to the computer, you can see the saddle, or that's the saddle differences on the uh, lighting and the build quality. Colors, patterns are very similar, but the lighting gives it away. This one definitely lights up more has more LED light behind it and it looks pretty good like I said before both mouses are good depending on what you're looking for and um, what you need them for just know what to look for whether it's an original Razer product or a Chinese Overwatch mouse uh, now you can defend yourself with that information and buy exactly what you're looking for so that was also X for 00x.com I'm gonna play Overwatch with the original Razer product right now thank you, peace and I'm out